the magnificent shoreline of Zanzibar, an island that's part of the Republic of Tanzania. To get here by ferry, it takes just two and a half hours from Dar es Salaam. And welcome back to CNN Business Traveller, where we're all about giving something back. In other words, how can we see the world's beauty spots and not do any damage? In many cases, this isn't about giving something up or giving something away. It's all about the choices we make on the road. In other words, how do we practice ethical travel? Ultimately, it's your hotel that will have taken most of your money. So here, make sure it's somewhere that's doing good in the community, like Matemwe Retreat. 80% of the staff here are employed from Matemwe Village up the road. Hotel profits have contributed to a new school, and foundations have been laid for a clinic that villagers say is badly needed. We give the opportunity to the guest. If someone is interested in um, supporting the, the local education, he can really see what we are doing. He can walk there, he can communicate with, with the locals, get a bit involved, understand it better, and even if they want to contribute more, they have a better feeling, understand, understanding what they are doing. Um, for example, the, uh, the turtle project. Turtles. Now, this is something to be seen. Tourist trails have trampled on turtle nests. But Chiroco is a villager in charge of a project which so far has rescued 40,000 eggs. And his watchful eye, the eggs are safe to hatch. Choosing a hotel with strong ethics may seem like a ton of hassle. With payoffs like this, it's worth every ounce. And that's CNN Business Traveller for this month. I'm Richard Quest in Tanzania and Zanzibar. We can do some good as we travel. Perhaps it starts with that little envelope on the plane. Wherever your travels may take you, I hope it's profitable. And remember the old rule, take nothing but photographs, leave nothing but footprints.